Hey guys, Nathan at Seek Outside. I'm coming to you from a long ways north of Toke, Alaska. And we're on a caribou hunt up here, flying caribou hunt. And I wanted to take a minute to cover staking with our tents because it is incredibly important. Now, when we got dropped off, uh, we had 20 to 30 mile an hour winds. It made it a real chore to get tents pitched. So what I did is to try to make room, I pitched my personal tent here at the end of this gravel bar. And the staking was awful. It's just a, almost a foot of loose gravel here. And I was in a 20 to 30 mile an hour wind. So what I did is I got my upwind stakes pitched first, upwind side of the tent pitched first, got the tent up, and then I started reinforcing. Now, all of the corner stakes on this silex, I'm using our twisted aluminum stake, which are large. And not only are they large, I've got heavy rocks put on top of them. I did use the upwind guy outs on the doors on this silex, so I'm using the leeward side as my entrance and exit. And I used the D-ring on the upwind pole to turn that into another guy out point. So in these type conditions where you've got a foot of loose gravel and high winds, if your stakes pull, your tent's gonna fall. So do whatever you have to do to keep that from happening. Heavy rocks, multiple guy out points, improvised stakes, use dead men if you need to. Uh, pitching the DST up here, we actually used a shed caribou antler as a dead man and buried it. So use your imagination on staking. Just get it as solid as you possibly can.